Welcome back to Marcus at Work Media. So your boy Drake has not learned his lesson. Apparently, he's been throwing out subliminals that it could be around two. Why would you do that, dude? What the what, what the fuck are you doing out here, man? So as of recently, he threw a couple subliminals out there about Kendrick Lamar on a No Face song, one of his mini leaks. And then on top of that, he's been posting on that ghost account that he dropped 100 gigs on about a possible round two. Did Drake just say that he's going to institute round two of the beef with Kendrick Lamar? That's what some folks are saying after he subliminally posted to his burner account, the one that he's been posting the 100 gigs on, this. Put it in the front page, back page, middle page, wherever, headliners, column one or two, we will win game two. Got back it off. We will win game two. Now there's several ways to look at this. One and probably most obvious is that this is the second round of songs that he's put out. So he's had two and several of the posts on the stories for this page. Um, second, that he is actually saying we're coming back for round two and we will round two, which then leads me to the third thing. Is he admitting that he lost the first round? Because if he's admitting he's lost the first round, a lot of y'all that have been wild in my comments since May, since before the summer started are the main ones who are going to have to sit back and recognize that your guy aubrey drake graham drizzy drake rogers is admitting that he didn't beat kendrick in round one bruh <laughs> so as a fan are you to believe that drake is stupid enough to do this again now i know all the drake stands is like hey you know go at it he never won in the first place go get him drake and then the k-dot fans it's like i mean it's like abuse at this point to continue. But if he's still calling Kendrick out, I mean, K-Dot, <laughs> mop the flow with him again. I don't know if it's just going to be a Lucy. Maybe it's that track that was on the beginning of the Not Like Us video. But I was told Kendrick is coming. And seeming like he lost and he wasn't a part of the All of that was bullshit. It was just some shit that people made up, tried to make a real thing, tried to throw into the game. It worked. It did not work. It Why didn't. did Drake, who has dominated the last 15 years of my Just life, have it. to remind us? Because that record worked. No, I'm telling you, it's because people were caught up in a moment. They were yeah, caught a in a great, moment. He, Kendrick smoked it. <laughs> yes, but when you say he lost, what did he lose? He didn't lose oh, anything. I I, I, he's music, fine. music wise, what did he lose? The battle. The battle. We'll win game two. I don't think that Drake is saying he wants to let's let's go back and forth with raps again. I think this is Drake's game two right here. I think Drake is dropping a palette of songs and creating an aura of music, you know, compilations and compositions and visual compilations that this is his game two. Let me do this mental gymnastic. Maybe game two is not another battle, but it's what happens after the battle. I've heard that Kendrick is loading up. Now, I don't know if that means an album. I don't know if he's finally going to start giving out the handouts of features that he probably promised them niggas who was who were crip walking and blood walking on that stage. I mean, are we to take this seriously? Could this possibly be what the situation is? So we'll see how all this pans out. But as of now, <laughs> it ought to be interesting because your boy is poking the bear. So Put your comments below. Let's talk about it. This is Marcus at Work Media, and I'm out this bitch.